Hey, this is different, isn't it? How's everybody doing this morning? And uh, in the spirit of things being different, stand by, watch this. This is 7 Minutes in the Morning, where five days a week you get tips and hacks dedicated to helping business owners and leaders just like you find and break through the one thing that is preventing your success. And now, here's the host of 7 Minutes in the Morning and your results coach, Tom Rigsby. Okay, feedback. Give me some feedback on that. Did you like that? I didn't give you much warning, did I? I might play it again at the end. Hey, good morning, everybody. Oops, my name is Tom Rigsby. This Seven minutes in the morning, coming to you live this morning from uh, the Jackson Center at Hudson Alpha as we are getting set up and ready for the big marketing and PR event here, sponsored by, hosted by, uh, yeah, look at that big head, the Catalyst Center for Business and Entrepreneurship. we will be doing the radio show live from here this morning. I actually recorded this episode last night in case I couldn't get all this to work, but it is working. So here we are. So I'm going to try and make it uh, quick this morning, but I do want to go ahead and say good morning to everybody. Good morning to Joe and Catherine, who have already uh, said hello. And if you are watching, whether you're watching live or on the replay, go ahead and leave a comment down there. Say hi. Let me know that you're here. And don't forget, give the old video a thumbs up. And if you happen to be listening on your uh, yeah, favorite podcast catcher or watching on YouTube, head over to 7minutesinthemorning.com. 7 minutes in the morning.com that gets you the right place where you can join the conversation. And yes, Catherine, I'm quite proud of myself actually. You should see the snake pit of wires. <laughs> I don't know, maybe I'll do that uh during one of the breaks on the radio show. Still not 100% sure that I'll be able to do the live stream in the radio show, but we'll see. So this week we're talking about finding and doing work that matters. Last week we talked about don't make ugly babies. This is kind of the opposite of that. And so today I wanted to talk to you about, just give you an, an idea to think about uh, for the rest of the day. This idea about work and what work is. We get this thought in our head, right, that work is just what we do. That's the eight to five, nine to five, whatever. It provides income for us to do all the other stuff. But there's something more to it than that. That's what I want to suggest to you today and give you to, to ponder on. All right? Work, by my definition, work is the net value that we leave behind. So if we, if we perform some task, we do some kind of work, we get compensated for that, you take the compensation out, is it a net positive amount? If it is then you have created net positive value. Your work has created positive value. If not, if, if that net is a negative, you're probably finding yourself uninspired, uh, not energized, not motivated to do your work, right? Because when we are doing work that, uh, that has an impact on ourselves, on other people, then we get that energy. We, it's like being here, man. It's, I mean, stuff's happening, right? So when we're doing the work that matters, the things that we are uniquely gifted, talented, and placed to do, then we will be energized by it. We'll be fulfilled by it. It's not something that we have to dread on Sunday night as we're thinking about starting a new week in the morning. Right? We look forward to getting up on Monday and jumping back into it because it's what we do. In fact, probably like me, you do it every day of the week. It's, you know, Saturday and Sunday is just, you know, an interesting day of the week. So that's what I want you to think about today. And it will be a little bit short today as I get some other stuff set up here. Let's see what Catherine has to say. Unlock your heart seed and then find your way to turn that passion into a profession. So I'll go along with that. I, I won't argue too vehemently with that. Um, I, I think we get um, we get passion. We mistake passion for gifts sometimes. So I have to be careful about that. But other than that, uh, I, I agree with you. That heart seed in your language, that heart seed, is what we are uniquely gifted and talented to do. Right? And we all have it, right? 
if you if if money, time, and location were not an object, here's a question for you: If money, time, and location were no object, what would you do? If you're not doing that now, then you're not doing what you are gifted and talented to do. Those things that you are gifted and talented to do will attract you to them. They'll be your hobbies. They'll be the things that you're interested in, the things you'll sit down and read books about, the things you'll watch movies about, that, that you'll make. They attract you to them. I mean, it's it's like a magnet, right? You're, you're half of it. That thing is the other half, and it's going to attract you to it. When you fight against that, right, you, you know, you flip the magnet around the wrong way, they repel one another. So don't fight against this attraction that you have to the things that you are uniquely gifted and talented to do. That's why you are gifted and talented in that way, is so you can do them, right? And look, here's another, I mean, this is a whole other show's worth of information here, but another important thing to think about, right? If you don't do it, and in the grand scheme of things, someone was depending on you being there to do it, What's going to happen to them? So you have a responsibility not only to yourself, but to the others who depend on your work product in order to do that. All right, look at that. I'm going to wind up making it a seven-minute show after all. Thank you so much for being here, for watching, for contributing. Be sure and watch the radio show. I'm going to cross my fingers that we get to pull that off. That's at uh, 8 o'clock. And you can watch that on Talk Radio for Entrepreneurs. Talk Radio for Entrepreneurs gets you to the right place. We'll do the radio show, or you can listen live. If you can't watch the live stream, WTKIRadio.com. Otherwise, see, today's Tuesday. Yeah, that's it. Otherwise, I'll be back here again in the morning with another installment of 7 Minutes in the Morning. You guys take care. Oh, wait, now I'll find my video. I don't have my keyboard. I'm all... I'm all... Just combobulated.